Ďalší veľký profesionál stojí po mojej právici, no tentokrát je to hráčka, jej meno je Vanessa Selbst a tá nám odpovie na pár otázok. Vanessa, hi. Hi. Uh, we spoke before the, we are recording. You said that you are here in Prague for the first time. How do you like it so far? I really like it. Um, I, I don't know, I've spent most of my time playing poker so far, but I, today I went to the Christmas markets and mm -hmm. we walked around, we walked up to the castle and stuff, so it's really nice. It's cool, like, old city and stuff, really nice. You already said to me that uh, you're out of the main event. Uh, yeah. Uh, what what are you gonna do now? Are you gonna play something something other, some other tournaments? Yeah, I mean this festival is really cool. There's like a ton of people and all the side events. I already played the PLO side event before, uh, before this, and I'll be playing the probably 2K and the high roller and I don't know. Yeah, there's tons of poker to play. Uh, a few minutes ago, we speak with Jay Cody. He was uh, he's out from the main event, and he's going to play the high roller. So it should be a good tournament. <laughs> I don't know what that means because you're like that, that was funny. You said uh, Jay Cody is going to play it, so that means it's going to be a good tournament. I think uh, Jay Cody is a good player. You're too, so it's going to oh, no, be a usually, nice party there. Yeah, usually when you say like it's a good tournament because someone's playing, it mm -hmm. means that they're like a fish. Oh, I didn't because, know that. like there's a lot of value, you know, like Jake Cody's playing, so like dead dead money, <laughs> dead money, you know. No, so. we are different television. I didn't mean that. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, that's very funny. Uh, no, I think, yeah, I think it's going to be a very good tournament, so I'm excited about playing that one. And, uh, you know, I have, uh, as uh, my uh, last person I was speaking to pointed out, I do not have any success on the uh, EPT so far. Mm. I've never made a final table of a main event, but I've done very well on the high rollers, so oh. that's uh, that's where I'm looking to, I guess, make my money. So hopefully I'll take this one down too. So maybe this could be a tournament today. I hope so. You already told us that you play Omaha. Do you like playing cash? Uh, yeah, I play cash, but I like tournaments a lot more, and I'm usually playing tournaments. Who you like to play against? Uh, I mean, uh, players from which country are best for your uh, uh, pocket? <laughs> well, uh, I don't know. There's there's like good players from all these different countries that are okay. coming up. But I, you know, I don't know. Historically, it's been like the like Italy, Spain, and yeah. France region where you know <laughs> you kind of like to play those players. But I don't know. Nowadays, there's like even really good Spanish players, which mm -hmm. is like totally, you know, even really good Italian players. You're yeah. like, where did you come from? So there's good players everywhere. I think poker is really developing in Europe and with the spread of poker stars coming, all these different tours like the Eureka Poker Tour and Estrella's Poker Tour in mm. Spain, all these different smaller poker tours. People are playing so much more. I really think they're improving and I don't know. I mean, there's still obviously tons of really bad players, but there's also really good ones. Mm. So, you know, it's just kind of, You know, I think that for sure the worst country now is Germany. You definitely want to avoid anybody from Germany. I think they've won like every single event this year. So uh, when they do something, they're like uh, like uh, Japanese. Practice <laughs> makes perfect. So so they're uh, leveled up all the time, and they are great players. Exactly. I think they have a very strict work work ethic. Yes, that's right. That's the words. Uh, you're a sponsored player from uh, Poker Stars, so you have to play online too. How you like it so far, and uh, what are your greatest success? Um, yeah, I don't play that much online uh, compared to most other pros. Like, I'm more of a live player, I guess. Every pro is different. So, like, I play, like, the Scoops and W Coops, and I'll play some Sundays and stuff like that. But, um, but yeah, I'm not. I'm more, like, traveling, and I'm usually going to, if I have a choice to play live or play online, I'm going to play mm -hmm. live because I think, for me, I just prefer it. Like, I'm more of, like, a social person. I like mm -hmm. being around other people and stuff. And so I don't really like being in my house as, as much as other people. But... Um, but yeah, I mean, I don't know. I, so no major successes. I made the Sunday Million final table a couple mm -hmm. times, but that's pretty much it. So you travel uh, around the world. What is the best destination for you to play? <sighs> Maybe someday where it's warm or uh, good weather, for example. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I love, I love London. Call me crazy. I love <laughs> London. I think it's such <laughs> a great You city. are, maybe. I know. Yeah, everybody <laughs> thinks that I'm crazy, but I love it. it it's like for me, because I'm like from New York, mm -hmm. it's the perfect mix of like European, European culture and New York mm -hmm. you know it's got that kind of old architecture uh, kind of small alleyways feel of Europe mm -hmm. but the culture is much more similar to New York and so I kind of like that mix and I've always felt really at home at London and so I, I would say that's probably my favorite stop. Do you have uh, any kind of rituals before the tournaments or stuff you do always before the tournament? Yeah I make a circle of stones and candles and I ah, pray on. to a god and okay. uh, no um, I don't know. I don't. I've, I'm always changing. I'm trying to change my game and my life depending on where I am and what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. And so, just I just try to like stay healthy, eat healthy, try to get some exercise, mm -hmm. play tennis as much as possible. Um, 
pretty much that. Like, I don't really have one set thing mm -hmm. that I do or anything like that. Just try to play it by ear. Okay, then, Vanessa, we thank you for the interview and we wish you good luck in the high roller. Thanks. Well, thank you so much. Thanks. Where's look left? They fall right into Kansas City shuffle. It's a they think you think you don't know type of Kansas City hustle. Where you take your time, wait your turn, and hang them up there.